The FAA continues to delay the Starship's second test flight, but SpaceX is not backing down. The company has decided to continue testing the Starship with a launch rehearsal, even if the FAA will not allow the rocket to take to the skies. Let's talk about this latest development and how it will help Starship in its eventual launch. SpaceX has consistently been leading the way in space technology, pushing boundaries and turning what once seemed like science fiction into reality. Their Starship, designed as a fully reusable spacecraft to carry humans to the moon, Mars and beyond, stands as a testament to their visionary approach. Now, after a period of anticipation, there is exciting news. SpaceX is back in action and gearing up to test the most highly anticipated rocket in the world, the Starship. There has been a lot of buzz surrounding this, particularly after the FAA's recent handoff to the Fish and Wildlife Service regarding the test date for the second Starship flight. In the latest update from SpaceX, they have officially informed the Coast Guard about their plans to conduct ground testing on the Starship very soon. These tests serve various purposes, including loading the rocket with propellant, testing its structural resilience, and possibly even conducting a full-fledged wet dress rehearsal, simulating the entire countdown to launch. A crucial aspect of these tests is the static fire test, where some or all of the rocket's engines are evaluated, providing invaluable data. This step is essential to ensure that everything is in optimal condition before an actual launch takes place. Adding to the excitement, SpaceX recently teased on Twitter, hinting at the Starship being fully stacked and their team gearing up for a launch rehearsal. They also confirmed ongoing collaboration with the FAA to secure a launch license. This tweet sparked immense enthusiasm within the space enthusiast community. Supporting these hints, there have been recent road closures around SpaceX's test site. Situated in Boca Chica, the Starship development site has seen remarkable progress in recent weeks. By the end of August and the beginning of September, the Starship underwent multiple static fires and received significant upgrades to its stage separation system. This rapid pace of development is a stark contrast to earlier progress reports. Many enthusiasts were optimistic based on the FAA's initial statements, hoping to witness the Starship soaring into the skies this month. With these ongoing developments, it's evident that SpaceX is poised to launch its colossal Starship rocket into space. The launch could potentially occur in the next few days, contingent upon various factors aligning smoothly. Space exploration is a complex endeavour that involves meticulous planning and coordination. It's not simply a matter of launching a rocket. Extensive preparations are necessary. This includes collaboration with various groups, rigorous testing on the ground, and ensuring the safety of every aspect involved. In this regard, SpaceX has communicated with the Coast Guard about these tests. The Coast Guard has designated cautionary zones extending all the way into the Gulf of Mexico. You might be wondering how the launch of a rocket involves the Fish and Wildlife Service. The explanation can be found in the aftermath of Starship's initial launch attempt in April. That test not only caused significant damage to the nearby infrastructure, but also had a noticeable impact on the local wildlife. Due to these unexpected challenges, the Fish and Wildlife Service has taken charge of approving any modifications to the launch pad. Following the damage incurred during Starship's April test, many people expected a lengthy recovery period. Some even speculated that Starship would be grounded for over a year. However, in a typical demonstration of SpaceX's adaptability and innovation, these predictions were proven wrong. Rather than investing months in extensive pad rebuilding, the company promptly integrated a cutting-edge fire suppression system. Its effectiveness was swiftly confirmed through a static fire, with observers vigilantly monitoring the bustling activities at the test site. Keen-eyed observers noted intriguing adjustments to the Starship system. One significant modification occurred after SpaceX fully assembled the Starship system. They meticulously removed and later reinstalled the interstage separation ring atop the Super Heavy booster. This change holds particular importance due to the challenges encountered during April's test launch, where the two stages of the Starship rocket struggled to separate properly during flight. The concept itself isn't entirely groundbreaking. The notion of hot staging where one rocket stage ignites while the preceding stage is still firing was a technique employed by older Russian rockets. However, SpaceX has taken this idea and potentially enhanced it, showcasing its ability to merge established techniques with state-of-the-art technology. Following the April flight, SpaceX made several upgrades at the system level, concentrating extensively on the core functionalities of the rocket. The primary enhancements were directed toward the rocket's engines and propulsion system. Additionally, they reinforced the system to prevent fires, demonstrating their commitment to not only innovation, but also safety and reliability in their space endeavors. During the Starship's initial test, there were some engine problems. This is particularly crucial for this rocket, as it employs a massive 33 engines, making it unique in its design. Addressing and resolving these issues is paramount for the upcoming launches. The importance of this Starship orbital launch attempt goes beyond SpaceX's ambitions. Since the conclusion of the Apollo missions in the 1970s, humanity has not returned to the lunar surface. For decades, the moon has remained an unexplored frontier. 
NASA's Artemis Lunar Exploration Campaign symbolizes a renewed ambition to revisit this celestial neighbor. In this grand return to the moon, NASA has recognized SpaceX and its Starship as pivotal partners. Through the Human Landing System program, NASA has allocated a substantial investment exceeding $4 billion in SpaceX. This significant financial commitment reflects NASA's clear intent. Starship is not just another spacecraft, but the chosen vessel to land the next generation of astronauts on the lunar surface. This partnership between NASA and SpaceX serves as a testament to SpaceX's technological expertise and its capability to execute complex and demanding missions. It highlights the confidence NASA has in SpaceX, acknowledging its innovative approach and pioneering spirit in advancing space exploration. Moreover, the partnership between NASA and SpaceX extends beyond the Artemis program. Over the years, NASA has awarded SpaceX multiple contracts involving diverse tasks, such as cargo resupplies to the International Space Station and the development of advanced crewed spacecraft. These collaborations signify a strengthening relationship and a growing level of trust between the two entities. It is evident that SpaceX, once a newcomer in the aerospace sector, is transforming into an essential and irreplaceable player in the realm of space exploration. Their ability to handle various responsibilities and their innovative strides characterize them as a cornerstone of the future of space exploration, solidifying their position as a key player in shaping the next chapter of humanity's ventures into space. Through these collaborative efforts, SpaceX is not merely forging its own route, but is also molding the trajectory of the entire space industry. In this evolving landscape, countries like China are aggressively enhancing their space capabilities. Unlike conventional competitors who operate with a collaborative spirit, China's approach has been more insular. This was apparent when they were excluded from the International Space Station, not solely based on technology or capability, but due to concerns regarding transparency, intellectual property, and international cooperation. Given this backdrop, SpaceX's Starship takes on an even greater significance. It stands as a beacon of innovation and international collaboration, showcasing a model where transparency and cooperation are fundamental. SpaceX's endeavors not only push the boundaries of technology, but also emphasize the importance of openness and shared efforts in propelling the entire space industry forward. In a global context, Starship represents not just a spacecraft, but a symbol of international cooperation and the potential for a unified future in space exploration. For now, the Starship must first complete a successful launch rehearsal and hope that the FAA finally grants SpaceX to test their mighty rocket once again. Do you think that the Starship will launch soon after the rehearsal? Please let us know in the comments below.